Okay, so we're having quite a problem. If you reinstalled or uninstalled the VMware, or you had to restart, reset your computer and reinstall Windows and all that good stuff. And now you're coming back to your VMware to open your virtual machines you had from before, right? This here VMX file. This was created years ago. But if I click open to open it, just normal, as you see, even the settings are set up nice. And I click and I get this error right here that has a configuration file was created by a VMware product that is incompatible with this version. Now, this is one of those kind of glitchy things that we have to go through really quick. But before we do anything, and if you click OK, it just gives you another error ticket right there. You will need to get a notepad plus plus first it's it's free i'll leave a link down uh below i don't understand what this has to do with notepad but it's okay that's not my uh, business but after you get notepad we need to modify the file and in this case the file is this vmx file as you see it's the same mcvm machine vmx this is the file we need to edit and we right click after you install the uh, notepad plus plus open it or edit with notepad plus plus and we need to find in this case is on the third line right here it says virtual hw dot version i will leave this wording down in the description and if you don't know how to find it and you have trouble finding it simply copy this phrase here that I'm going here, copied from my uh, description of this video, click CTRL and F to find this exact uh, piece pasted here. As you see, it goes here and hits find next. And it will find you directly this one. In here, as you see, we have 21. This is our problem. This number 21 here is our problem. Let me close this one. If we go to help, and click about this machine as you see the version we have is 17 it doesn't matter 0 0.0.1 0 .1 and the build patch and all that that disregard that part that's none of our problem our problem is this number here 17 so let's say your machine is 15 if you have the older version well this number here is what you need we take this number 17 we go to the notepad and take this number 21 and make it 17. This is literally all. And I'm going to hit file. I'm going to hit uh, save. Not save us. Save. That's it. We are done here. Now let's open the virtual machine again. The same file that we edited that number from 21 to 17. That says MC VM machine VMX. I'm going to click open. And then I'm going to power on this virtual machine and see if it goes on. And by now it would have given me the error it's not so that means it's working good and uh, disregard this here because i don't let my virtual machines access all my devices <laughs> because i use these machines kind of a burner windows boom we are already getting inside windows it was that easy look at that and we have the entire uh, machine that was created a million years ago going on uh, i don't need this remind me later boom could not access nope because i don't want the network drives connected to what it wants i connected it to the vpn only and if the vpn is off virtual machine doesn't have network because you know i test weird stuff on machines like viruses and that kind of stuff or maybe even suspicious links that come to my email i never ever click those links on my uh main windows here i always have one of these virtual machines open on the side just in case or testing new software. Maybe it's a software I don't know about. I test it here first just in case something happens. Bah, it's a virtual machine. I don't care. Versus testing it on your main machine because that, that hurts. <laughs> that hurts if something goes wrong. But yeah, that's uh, how easy it is to actually fix that. Just keep in mind, go to wherever you have your virtual machines, like here. Mine is this one right here. Right click, Notepad++, this virtual hw.version. Turn it from whatever number it was to the number that your virtual machine has currently, which here is 17. And I hope this video helped somebody out there. Hit that thumbs uh, up, like, subscribe, whatever those things are. You, you, you know the thing. <laughs> Bye for now. See ya.